Time to make another dress form. This one will be an applique. Hey Kimberbell friends, Kristen Som here continuing with Candy Corn Quilt Shop. So today we're going to make another dress form. I have a funny little story about this one. So Katrina, I don't remember her last name off the top of my head, sorry, but Katrina uh, posted when we did, I think it was block eight or nine, when we did the first dress form, she posted the wire dress form and the applique dress form and it somehow didn't occur to me <laughs> that she was working ahead. And so I was like, oh, that's so cool. How did you do it as an applique? <laughs> I thought that was funny. So obviously I figured it out shortly after, but um, now we're going to do that applique one like Katrina did. <laughs> so that's in our Kristen Creates group. If you haven't joined the Kristen Creates group, make sure and join that. We're having so much fun working on this quilt together. So today, solid dress form, and we are going to use some products for that. In fact, we've got our flexifoam again. So this flexifoam is going to be cut to two and a half by four for our solid dress form, two and a half by four. And like I said, I use my regular needles when we're using flexifoam, so you should be fine. Um, so for our main fabric on this one, it is the white with orange dots. In our kit, there's a couple of these. Um, there's white with gray dots, I think it is, or black, I think it's black dots. Um, so make sure and use the one that is the white with the orange dots for this. And we're gonna cut our main piece of fabric to six and a half by eight and a half. And as always, make sure to back this with fusible stabilizer, it'll help ward off puckers. So six and a half by eight and a half. And then we just have one applique piece with that flexifoam, like I mentioned. And it is the black with white dots for our applique piece. And that one we're going to cut to two and a half by four. And I do back these with fusible stabilizer as well. As you can see on these little ones, I like to use the scraps that I have. <laughs> so two and a half by four for the black with white dots applique piece. And that same with the flexifoam, also two and a half by four. And then we are going to quilt this one. So we're going to use our batting. And for our final cut size today is four and a half by six and a half. So that means that we want a piece of batting that is five by seven, at least five by seven for your batting. And then for our quilting, we're going to use that Hobby 2 again. We're getting lots of use out of that new one. I just bought it the other day. So um, Hobby 2 in four by six since our final cut size is four and a half by six and a half we're going to use the quilting design that is four by six hobby two it's that cute one with the uh, spools of thread and needles all right and um that's it i think we're all ready so let's go ahead and get started with this fun easy applique piece one gosh we're almost done <laughs>
are you getting ready for Christmas already? What's our next project after Candy Corn Quilt Shop? Hey Kimberbell friends, Kristen Som here. And yes, I am wearing a Santa sweater in August and I'm doing this for you. <laughs> so I have received questions of what we're gonna work on after Candy Corn Quilt Shop because I know a lot of people are getting excited about Christmas already. So we have a new sponsor and we are going to do Candy Cane Lane, the bench pillow. And the sponsor for this project is your best friend's quilt shop. And they are in Idaho, like I am. So I have never been up there. Um, I hear it's, I think, maybe four hours away from me in Grangeville, Idaho. And just the sweetest gal. So she was the first to respond um, with this new quilt. That's not quilt, sorry, bench pillow that's coming out. And so here's some information. It's called Candy Cane Lane, it's a bench pillow, and right now there are pre-orders going on. So I'm going to ask you that if you're gonna do this project, please sponsor our sponsor, because that is what gives us our free tutorials, right? So um, I'm able to get sponsored by a quilt shop, and in turn, I give them advertising, and so that they can get those pre-orders in, and we can all have fun together with our tutorials. So what you need for this is the machine embroidery CD, the fabric kit, which does include the backing, and the embellishment kit, and then you can also get the optional thread kit. All of these items are available for pre-order right now at your best friend's quilt shop, and here is a link. I also have something cool. She is going to, the owner is Christina, and she is going to provide you with a discount code here. <laughs> This code will give you 12% off all of the items that you need for Candy Cane Lane Bench Pillow. And if you spend over $100 on your order, you'll get free shipping too. So please sponsor our sponsor. I think that's all the information I need. Your best friend's quilt shop. And like I said, she's already got the items listed as a pre-order. I think that they come out in September, October. I'm not sure, but hopefully right about the perfect timing for us to work on and finish our candy corn quilt shop quilt. <laughs> so we're just jamming along with all kinds of fun stuff. And thank you to our sponsors. Also, if you look in the description of the video, right below the video, there is a description and it's got links to everything that you could need and more information about the project. So check that out. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already.